In this video we will go over how to use the aux outputs on the Yamaha TF1 mixer. The aux output sends are located on the right of the mixer. There are 8 mono aux buttons labeled aux 1 through aux 8 and 6 stereo aux buttons labeled aux 9 and 10 through 19 and 20. To send signal to an aux output, select one of the buttons. For example, press aux 1. The aux 1 button will begin flashing blue and the scribble strips will display send to aux 1. This means levels are now being adjusted for the aux 1 output instead of the main system output. Once in aux 1 mode, make sure that the aux 1 master on the right is turned on and turned up to the zero mark. In Daktronic systems, aux 1 is normally used for the announcer's interface as a headphone monitor for the announcer so they can hear themselves. The announcer's microphone is on channel 1 of this mixer. Make sure channel 1 is turned on using the on button and turn up the fader for channel 1 to the desired level to send it to the aux 1 output. Let's say the announcer wants to hear the CD player as well. Locate the CD channel, make sure it is turned on and turn it up until the announcer has the mix that they want. For any channels past channel 16, select the input 2 button to access channels 17 through 32. Select another aux button so that it starts flashing and use the faders to send channels to that aux output. To go back to adjusting level for the main system output, press the aux button that is flashing blue. The aux button will stop flashing and the words send to aux will disappear from the scribble strips. Thank you for watching this presentation. If you have further questions about our products, please contact the Dactronix audio representative. Feel free to view our other training videos available at www.dactronix.com support. Keyword sports sound.